Hello everybody, welcome back to Size Matters. I'm Keith Webb. I am Rosie Ricardo. Thank you so much for watching. Yeah, hey Rosie. I live in Vegas, so there's a and huge- so do I. You do too. I do too. Why don't we hang out more often? <laughs> you never call me. That's true. And plus you have kids. Uh, and anyway. you're a baby. And I'm a baby, yeah. She'd have to babysit me instead. I know, I don't want to babysit anymore. Okay, let's go back to Vegas. Okay, so what do you feel about what's happening in Vegas? You go to a lot of nightclubs. I do. But you are tall and good looking and have a beautiful body. Okay. Thank in you. Vegas perspective. Okay, you know yeah. how Vegas nightclubs Vegas are on Saturdays sure. and Sundays, okay? Yes. The lines, the people, the beautiful people, the outfits, the names, and of course, size discrimination is found in Hakkasan's nightclub in Las Vegas, no whales, no hippos. Is that what To it a says? bachelorette party who was asked for pictures because they did not want any big girls or anybody that was not a 10 at the club because that is Hakkasan's. Hakkasan's is Hakkasan's, the, the big grand name of nightclubs. So is this happening in, in just Hakkasan or is this happening in No, club? no, this has happened in excess. This is a, bit, a different nightclub that I've experienced personally. I'm um, being on red carpet events. I mean, I got kicked off a red carpet event when I had to interview for the Kardashians and I wasn't allowed on the red carpet, of, red carpet because I was the only overweight reporter there. And this was when I was a lot heavier and this was about a year and a half ago. They, did, they told me that I wasn't up to their standards to please leave and I was not invited to be at red carpets again. So when this news hit me about Hakkasan's, I really was thrown back because of the biggest name that was out there. It's Hakkasan's, I've mm -hmm. been there before. And of course, it's the promoters and the prom promoters are the face of the company. Right. And um, I mean, they had it out there. They needed pictures and they needed, you know, to find out who's gonna be part of the party for this bachelorette party. Mm -hmm. And when you see, we don't want any whales or hippos there, you know, what does that tell you? Did they you? actually say that? It said that on the text. They had the screenshots of the image, um, of the images of the text on there going to this girl. So she decided to take it to Jezebel.com and that's when everything unleashed. It caught my attention because it's my hometown. I love Vegas. I used to love Hakkasan's until I really saw this. This just kind of took was so, it over. That was so stupid. Why would you say that? That's Ooh. like that's like the person from Abercrombie saying, "I don't like fat chicks." So oh it's like, God. Yeah, how's your business doing, buddy? Yeah, no, that's that's terrible. You know, and I, you know, I don't really care for the clubs, but if I have to go, sometimes I'll make an appearance and I'll go to the club, and it's so funny. It ma it makes sense because I'll go in there and be like. There's, there's no girl that's really here. That's my type. I'm like, well, hold on. Not only that? that, isn't there a standard? Because they don't do that to men. Why is it only women? Men can get in. There's there's different types of men at the clubs, all ages, all sizes. No discrimination to that. But when it comes to women, we get discriminated by don't, size. Don't women get in for free? Yeah, but yeah. Exactly. If no, hold on. Women get into free if they are thin and they're they're a, they're a ten in Vegas standards. Well, I don't think anybody cares as long as the guy's paying. They don't care what a guy look like as long as you're dressed clean. They don't care because you're paying to get in. Women, they want women to come in for free. So if we're gonna have you in for free, you you better be good looking and help bring in business. Women, but hold women on, good looking by by whose standard though? By their standards, by by society standards. They they want the model, thin looking woman. That's what they want. And that bring to them. That's but what US brings in money. But U.S. isn't thin anymore. Like the sixty percent, seventy percent of U.S. people are overweight. So what the heck is going on? We know that, but people are still behind in the times. You know, behind in, no, behind in the times no. Look out everywhere. You go out everywhere. There's no behind in the times. It's all it's all over the place. Yeah. And women are all over the place, all different sizes. We're starting to fight for our rights. We're starting to fight to stop discrimination. And these are one of the moments that just kind of blows out our proportion, proportion. You could be making so much money if you really know how to promote and educate the people that work for you because they are the face of your company. Stop discrimination, let these women in. They're going, coming to Vegas because Vegas, what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. You ruin someone's opportunity based on their looks, on really the moment to experience Vegas for what it is. It's Sin City, baby. You're very passionate Sorry. about Sorry, oh, it got me, that got me going. Hakkasan's, no, 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 no. Okay, so this also in the news that took place. Uh, so, good moment. moving on. Uh, Fatkini. Have you heard about the Fatkini Absolutely. Movement? Thanks to Gabby Fresh who started the whole thing last year. That's this right. whole thing went viral. Women plunging in and really showcasing the beauty of their curves on the Fatkini right. hashtag. And I remember seeing this last year. Uh, I remember it was on Yahoo and I saw this this big girl. I was like, oh man, with this nice little bikini. I was like, who's that? I click on that. And it's Gabby Fresh who kind of started the Fatkini trend and now it just now is taking off From in the media. Ago, yeah. On mainstream media. But now it's taking off this year in mainstream media because now the women are buying it 
and they're uh, they're taking pictures, uploading and it, hashtagging and hashtagging it. Fat Kini. So you can just see a row of confident, sexy women just loving their body and loving their new swimsuit. Now, there so. has also been a little bit controversy because they say Gabby Fresh has the perfect body for the Fat Kini. So is there really a size appropriate um, body type for the Fat Kini? And I say, you know what? If you feel comfortable, you love your curves, and you, you feel comfortable showcasing them on the Fat Kini, more power to you. Show the world what your beauty is and show how good you look in a Fat Kini and make sure and hashtag it. Yes. So thank you, Gabby Fresh, for starting that. Thank you. And anytime you come and interview, Come to me, and you know, we'll interview you, and you can wear your fat kini. Yeah, you can... have a crush on her. Let's 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 stay focused on that. She's so. the perfect for, girl for that outfit. Oh, mm -hmm. yeah, she's got a beautiful body. A beautiful body. Yeah, for she look amazing Great. in that. Yes. So with that said, we want to empower more women to take pictures in the fat kini and follow that. I'm actually going to be doing it. I'm just recovering from surgery, but I'm going to be doing that. And I'm excited about hashtagging a fat kini. That'll be my first time in a fat kini. Fat hey. kini hashtag. Woo. <laughs> I go on there all the time. Um, so. With that being said, so Hakkasan, you know, no hippos, no, uh, not allowed. And with the Fat Kini movement, tell us what you think in the comment section. Uh, Please start a conversation. Please share, absolutely. Share. Yep. Share this video. You know what, we want to get our voice out. We want to know what you think. We want to connect with you. So make sure to like this video, share it. Follow us on Facebook and Twitter and like us and follow us as well on Instagram and direct messages. We want to chat with you. Yes, and if you really love our conversations and where this is going, subscribe. Absolutely. So. This is Rosa Mercado and with I'm my co-host Keith Webb. Thank you for watching Size, Size matters. matters, where things we talk about really matter. Mm -hmm.